The longest holdout for a number one draft pick in two decades is over. Hi, and welcome to the Daily Sports Update presented to you by Toyota. I'm Amber Wilson. Top draft pick Jamarcus Russell finally signed and got onto the practice field with the Oakland Raiders on Wednesday. Russell was reportedly guaranteed a record $29 million in his six-year $61 million deal. Russell's deal topped the previous record held by number two draft pick Calvin Johnson, who got a $27.2 million guarantee from the Detroit Lions a few months back. Last year, top big Mario Williams got $26.5 in guarantee money from the Texans, so the trend is looking good for next year's number one draftee. Russell was happy to put the business behind him, though, and get back to the basics. Uh, it feels great. Uh, my first day back felt kind of awkward. It seemed like uh, I haven't played football in all my life. <laughs> but uh, it's wonderful just to get back and uh, just to get along with the other guys and get my first day of practice out the way. Staying in the NFL, but on to its darker side. After days of cheating accusations against one of the most successful teams in NFL history, its leader has spoken. After speaking with NFL Commissioner Roger Goodell, New England Patriots head coach Bill Belichick released a statement Wednesday apologizing to those affected by the scandal. Commissioner Goodell could go as far as suspending Coach Belichick, but most likely will take draft picks from the team as punishment instead. He said that it was an issue that he was going to handle, so um, I think the best thing that we can do is focus you know, on getting our responsibilities down as, as players and uh, you know, all the rest of that stuff will take care of itself. There's nothing we can really do about it. Um, it's a situation that happened and you know, we're moving forward. Are we embarrassed? No. I didn't have nothing to do with that victory on Sunday, so you know, I'm not embarrassed. I'm proud of the fact that we're 1-0 and we're moving into week two. Now on to the diamond and on to some good news. Jim Tomey unleashed Wednesday, putting himself just one homer away from the coveted 500 club. His 499th home run drove in three runs to lead the Chai Sox past his former team, the Cleveland Indians, 7-4. 37-year-old Tomey will become the 23rd player to reach the 500 mark and the third this season, joining Alex Rodriguez and Frank Thomas. Tommy has given the White Sox something to cheer about as their season comes to a close, but across Chicago, the Cubs are hoping to cheer right into the postseason by taking a share of the lead in the NL Central after a win against the Astros. The Cubbies beat the Astros 3-2 Wednesday night, moving into a tie with the Milwaukee Brewers. Chicago snapped a four-game losing streak in Minute Maid Park. They entered the day one game behind the Brewers in the NL Central, but their win, coupled with the Brewers' loss to Pittsburgh 7-4, gave them a share at the top of the pack. Now let's take a look at some news and notes from around the world of sports. The St. Louis Rams placed left tackle Orlando Pace on injured reserve, ending the seven-time Pro Bowler season. Pace tore his labrum and rotator cuff and will soon undergo surgery. It's expected it'll take him about six months to recover. New York Jets quarterback Chad Pennington will also miss time. He will not play Sunday against the Baltimore Ravens due to an ankle injury. No official announcement has been made yet, but backup Kellen Clemens is expected to get the start. New York Knicks guard Stephon Marbury testified yesterday in the sexual harassment case against head coach Isaiah Thomas. Fired team vice president Brown Sanders sued for $10 million and her job back. Marbury called the lawsuit a joke. And that'll do it for the Daily Sports Update presented to you by Toyota. Keep your mouse clicking right here at CBSSports.com for everything you need to know in the world of sports. And if you missed anything here today, stop, refresh, and rewatch. I'm Amanda Wilson. Have a great one.